Now on to Epstein, man. Um, you know, this story's been in the alternate media for like like since it, you know, it took place years ago. Um, now it's in the mainstream media. Um <laughs> this guy got the, the sweetest deal of all Swedish deals. Swedish sweet Swedish <laughs> deal, not a Swedish deal. That was a that was a Freudian slip right there. <laughs> Because he definitely got a Swedish deal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, they gave him the sweetest deal of all time, man. I know people that did less, like, you know, way less than he did. They upstate for decades. Man, you my know, this guy would do more time work. in jail for a dime bag than he got. <laughs> yeah, that was crazy. You know, and um, I don't know. It's everywhere. You know, Acosta had to come out and say, man, it wasn't my fault. The state prosecutors in New York gave him that sweet ass deal. I'm like, oh, my God. Now nobody want to take no goddamn blame. Mm. That one was well, like 2005 or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, whoever it is, his attorney is, he, you know, they got that OJ clout. Dershowitz was his attorney. <laughs> Dershowitz? Yeah. Wow. Yo, Dershowitz, Dershowitz, you know, because they wrote on in, in, the, in the plea, him and his co-conspirators. Dershowitz, all them cats, that's how they got everybody clean, got all them immunity. How mm. you, like how Costa said, oh, we were giving them immunity because we wanted the big fish. When you gave the big fish, like, house arrest, <laughs> and he at home in his office 12 hours a day. Oof, boy. They didn't charge him with um, sexual assault. They charged him with prostitution. Right. He got, I want to say, did less than a year in jail. And in fact, he didn't even have to stay in the jail overnight. <laughs> what kind of jail sentence is that? <laughs> like, damn, you you just leave jail and like it's a job. You just come home, come back the next day. And you know he called out once or twice, like I ain't gonna make it in the day. <laughs> Yo, there is knowing people and knowing people. He really knew some people, man. Yeah, oh my god, he knows. Acosta, some people. Yeah, see, the thing is, in in um, see, Acosta they asked Acosta this question at his, when he was uh, when he's interviewing for Trump's cabinet, and they said he told him that Ep. Epstein was above his pay grade and he was an intelligent he was in intelligence. Mm. Then they asked him it this just the other day and he gave some long drawn out answer. He didn't he didn't say yes or no though. You know what I'm saying? So uh I don't know, man. This like this thing, you know, I'm not gonna get into all craziness, but this like some people like Jeff Jeff Curtis just thanks for the donation. He's an intelligence honeypot. That's what it seems like to me, man. He's running a blackmail operation. Yeah, he he uh he got some mean connections to get off on trafficking minors and trafficking women bodies and then walk away with prostitution. That's a mean hookup, bro. You know, and he still got people on the inside because listen, I was watching an interview with one of the girls, right? And she said he, he, she had ran away from him, and she was a good, away from him for years. Then he called. All of a sudden, she got a call one day, and it was the girl. And they were like, "Did you talk to anybody?" He's like, "She was like, no, nah, she never said anything." The next day, she got another call. This was Epstein. He was like, "Did you say anything?" She was like, "No." Then the next day, the FBI called. So how did? Epstein know before the FBI. You know, he he knew the FBI wanted to talk to her. He got to talk to him before the FBI talked to him. Yo, this is straight out of Netflix special. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <laughs> how you get the info before the FBI? I, I'm under, I don't like how is that even possible? <laughs> I'm doing something wrong in this world, bro. <laughs> I need to up. I need to up my circle. I don't want to be around no more black people no more. I want that level. <laughs> Hotez, this is the last episode of Hotez been told you. I need to find out <laughs> who I need to know to know information before the FBI. <laughs> Jesus. Now he hasn't been arrested, right? 
Huh? He hasn't been arrested. No, right? he's a, he's a, he had a bond hearing that he, they didn't uh, they didn't grant it. I don't think because he he offered up his mansion and everything like seventy seven million dollar crib. And it's like, no, nah, man, this is crazy. So yeah, but I have you know there hasn't been any pictures of him in in his in 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 the orange jumpsuit. Like why didn't they perp walk him? You know what I'm saying? Like come on, yeah. man. So they did take him in. Yeah, he's 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 locked up. Oh, he's locked up. Yeah, but we ain't get no perp walk. No, they got him like he was coming all out off from the airport from I think he was coming from France or something. So we don't have any footage of him getting arrested. I haven't seen it. If somebody in the chat has seen it, please drop the link. But I have not seen any footage of Jeffrey Epstein being perp walked or in handcuffs. I mean, he might not even be in there. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you know, with his type of connections, if you know the F, if you know information before the FBI, if when you did get sentenced, you didn't have to be there all day, you might not be there now. <laughs> 